Welcome to the Promotional Product Show. My name is John Clark with Palm Tree Promotions powered by Halo. I'm in Orlando, Florida, and I'm joined by my co-host Dan Toombs with, from CopyGift over in the UK. Say hello, Dan. Hello, everyone. Hey, there you are. All right. So uh, on today's episode, I um, wanted to kind of go over uh, some of the, the the promotional products that I was uh, fortunate to uh, pick up at the ASI Orlando show that happened at the beginning of this month, and uh, there's some kind of new items and there's some old standbys that I just wanted to kind of give you some some uh, I don't know unique items that maybe you haven't seen before uh, or maybe some that you didn't realize that were actually promotional products that you could imprint your logo on. Uh, but nonetheless, you know, I have five or six, and uh, I guess, Dan, I'll just jump right in. Well, yeah, that sounds great. I think it should be mentioned that uh, we tried to do this show a couple a couple of weeks ago when you were uh, actually at the show, like we've done a, a couple times before, but it wasn't possible, was it? So uh, at least we get to see the uh, samples and everything. Yeah, yeah, you know, I mean, I really wanted to do that. It, it would have been a real fun time. And you know the the technology was great outside the convention center, but when you got inside, it just wreaked all kinds of havoc, and there was no consistent bandwidth, and it just would have been pretty horrible. So, um, well, well, well. That it and now we're doing it now. Yeah, so, we've got there in the end. Yeah, yeah. So I guess maybe what I want to start off with is this is a product, and, and I'll uh, lift it up here to the, for the camera to see. This is something that I use on a daily basis because I wear eyeglasses. And there have been a lot of companies that have come out with these. I particularly like this one because, hey, I branded it with all of my information. Um, but what it is, it, it's a 6 by 6 piece of microfiber cloth. And it is really soft. It cleans your glasses nice and, and clean and the best thing about it is man you got a lot of imprint area now this is something for somebody that, that wears glasses I wear them so I can see other people wear them uh, as readers or most people have a pair of sunglasses too because they go outside now Dan you probably don't see a whole lot of sunshine where you are right no it's snowing <laughs> Yeah. So, well, you still you, you might need some sunglasses. Uh, just call them snow glasses. Yeah. Uh, yeah. But this is a great item. They're they're inexpensive. Uh, I think they they go for you know actually somewhere between maybe seventy cents to a uh, dollar fifty, depending on if you're doing a single color print or, in my case, another shameless plug, full color. You can do full color on this, and it is crisp. It is clean. Uh, kind of printing, and you can get real, real fine detail on this. Man, these these are great. Uh, you know, I, I started wearing glasses for the first time in my life about four years ago, and there's not a day that uh, I go without having one of these in my pocket. Sometimes I have two or three of them just because I know I'm going to leave something, or I'm uh, it gets in the laundry and gets washed, and then I don't know where it goes. So I have a stockpile of these. Um, have you seen these before, Dan? Yeah, I have. I saw them at the last show I went to um, down in uh, Birmingham. Yeah. Uh, well, and, yeah it's, a great product. it's also, I'm sure it's also very good for uh, iPads and, and, you know, kind of mobile devices, aren't they? Yeah. So they're yeah. perfect for everyone, really. Exactly. You know what? I was just going to say that uh, I left a huge part of the population out because they're perfect for your smartphones and for your tablets and your computer screens. I mean, they work wonderful. And the best thing about it, is if they get dirty, all you do is throw them in the in the laundry. They wash and, and dry beautifully, and uh, you have it as good as new. So yeah. I mean, it's reusable. Yeah, I, I've got one of my own actually. I don't have it here with me today, but I do. I I, I swear by the product. I think they're really good. Yeah, and, and it, you know, if anybody out there that that might do a little direct mail for marketing, it's a perfect piece to add in. I mean, you fold it up. It's nice and thin. Um, you know, it, it can come with a, a plastic uh, uh, plastic case, and it's the perfect, um, I guess, addition to a, uh, a letter that you send in the mail. 
that makes it just a little bit lumpy, and people are going to like want to open that envelope to find out what's in there. And yeah. this is a beautiful, nice little gift, and it doesn't add to the postage for a, a standard uh, envelope. So it serves uh, quite a few different purposes. Um, yeah, the, the slogans are endless that, that you could imagine. Yeah, I mean, you know, for, for me is something like, hey, let's let's keep your promotions clean and, and shiny. Or, I mean, there, there's lots of different ways that you could uh, craft a marketing message to make it make, it make sense. Yeah, I'm glad, you brought that, I'm glad you brought that up for everyone's attention today, actually, because we've got our new catalog coming out. I think I'm going to send them out with it because it's, it is, it is, it's just a, a different product that everyone can use no matter who they are. Exactly. You know, and I send out, uh, when, when people place orders or when they do kind things, you know what, I have thank you cards. And this is another item that everybody should be using in business. This is the old-fashioned way of doing business and making sure that your brand stays in the top of mind. And, and this is just a nice, the right thing to do. This card actually has uh, plants and, and uh, flowers seeds embedded in it. You can kind of see, see if I get it up real close. You can see the seeds. They're all embedded in this card, and it's biodegradable paper. And on the back of it, it says, plant me, water me, watch me grow. And so I place one of these eyeglass cleaners as a nice little thank you gift inside my thank you note inside the envelope. And then I always write a little... Um, a little message on the inside saying, "Hey, turn me over for a surprise," and then it shows that it, it you know takes them to the imp uh, instructions on the back to uh, plant, uh, just plant me, water me, and then watch me grow. And so my marketing message and my memory gets passed along even further because you're um, you just are going to remember a cool little thank you gift like that that just the gift keeps on giving as the plants grow. I like that card. I've never seen those. That's something I haven't seen over here. Yeah, and it's uh, made by uh, Floral Promotions, uh, one of our suppliers over here. And um, I'll, I'll give you the information um, uh, privately so that you we can go look them up. Yeah, I think I'll, I'll definitely do that. That's a, that's, that's a good little card. Okay. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> different um, yeah, now the next item is something that, man, I've known about this for a long time, but this right here is custom packaging. And this is, it's a box. And it looks like a Cracker Jack box, right? Mm -hmm. It's larger than a, crack, than a standard Cracker Jack box because inside this box is houses a full-size t-shirt that's compressed. Mm. So this is a great uh, package. This particular client used these boxes. They didn't do the t-shirts. Um, the t-shirts you can do separately. You don't have to do the t-shirts. They loved the box and they opened up this, this uh, bar uh, called Sideshow here in downtown Orlando. And um, it's this freaky place that kind of has a circus theme, and so the Cracker Jacks just fit in real nice with their theme. And they actually had Cracker Jacks, big bulk items, and they had someone uh, uh, for their uh, grand opening VIP party that they handed out these boxes and filled with uh, uh, caramel corn. And as people were going around and had a drink in one hand, had their box of caramel corn in the other, watching all these freak shows on the side uh, at Sideshow. And this th this is a great, great item. And we customized every aspect from the side to the back to the ingredients where it says serving size, one night, servings per week, seven. You know, I, I mean, it's a bar that's open seven days a week, uh, uh, 365 days a year. Um, you know, it gets down into... Um, these the ingredients, you know, booze, beer, music, people, oddities, curiosity, and a dash of attitude. You know, so I mean, we customized everything about this box, and um, that, this is just a, a, a fantastic uh, packaging. It really brings any promotion to to life. Um, custom packaging is a great addition to any promotion that people are looking to do. 
So, so, the, so is the box, does it come as a Cracker Jack box, but do you then, do you then personalize, or can you have anything on the box? Oh, yeah, you can have anything on the box. I mean, it, it comes in a plain white. Uh, it's just a piece of, it, it's a white canvas. And, right. so, you know, we designed this. We, we took their logo. We took some of their ideas, and then we custom created this entire thing. Now, this particular supplier has the rights to use the Cracker Jack emblems and trademarks right. and so we're able to do that as part of this otherwise you know we'd be infringing on trademarks but this particular supplier this factory that produces these boxes has the rights and is allowed to um, you know resell the uh, Cracker Jack brand on the box. Do they, have, so. do they have rights to other brands as well that they're interested in? You know I, I, I don't know I think that they may but I know for sure that they do with the Cracker Jacks, and for this particular client, it was that's what they wanted. So, Perfect. <laughs> um, yeah. So, I, you know, I don't know. Uh, they are the the this particular supplier is called uh, Simply Sm uh, Simply Smashing, and they're out of Central California. Right. Oh. Yeah. So, um, but I again, I I'll send you their information as well. <clears throat> Uh, here in the states, there's a lot of different companies that do the uh, 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 compressed T-shirts, and these guys go above and beyond. They have a lot of really cool custom packaging that you don't need to put T-shirts in it. You can put tissues, you can put whatever it is, or you can just have the box or the mm. package. Yeah. Great. So one new item that you I hadn't seen before in our industry that now companies can brand their logo with is those flavored water drops. Are those all the rage over in the UK like they are here in the United States? Flavored water drops. It sounds like something my kids have used. It, it's it, The first company that brought it out was called Mio. And mm. it, it's a flavor enhancing water drops. It's concentrated flavors that you just, just put a, a three or four drops uh, into a glass of water and it uh, makes it taste like whatever flavor it comes in. This particular one, I think, is uh, acai, grape, and pomegranate, and it's like a berry drink. Mm. So it, these are, uh, you know, uh, flavored enhancing water drops, and, man, they're, they've just taken over. I mean, uh, I think the first ones were around maybe five, six, seven years ago, and now there are, are entire sections of a grocery store with all the enhanced water flavors. All right. So that might be something that I'm hasn't, sure, I'm sure hasn't been over there. some of those. So, yeah, yeah. So you know, one of my favorite flavors is lemonade. Um, and instead of you know taking a scoop of the powder and mixing it in, well, you yeah. can squirt concentrated drops, and you can have lemonade by the glass. Now these come in a bunch of different flavors, and then you get your uh, custom full color label right on the front of the bottle. That's brilliant. That that's excellent. Yeah, and uh, so you know, in the retail store, um, the, each bottle is about three dollars and seventy nine cents, three dollars and sixty nine cents. Uh, these, obviously, you buy them in, in a larger quantity because you know you want to hand them out to your customers and uh, use them in direct mail or use them at a trade show uh, to ha as a giveaway. They are much less expensive buying them in bulk than you can buy one at a time of the branded, um, you know, stuff at, at the grocery store. Cool item. I love this. I love flavoring my water. And when I saw these, I go, "Oh man, this is awesome! I can't wait to use it." That's an excellent product. Yeah. So um, one of the next items it, that I wanted to show is again it has to do with custom packaging too. This is a company that really wants you to play on people's emotions because the more the cool thing about promotional products and the effectiveness of them as part of a marketing plan is that people get to touch and feel and play around with them. Now this one is like a puzzle and it's a square uh, cube that starts to open up and then there's more look at all this imprint area and mm -hmm. then it opened up more and there could be a calendar here and then you could just start playing with it tactile stuff where you can touch it feel it play around with it 
you know, people, uh, like, they just, I, wow, this just keeps going around in circles. And then, you know, you have the different kinds of imprint areas. You have tons of imprint area on here that you can use. You can print QR codes. Do you guys use these a lot over in the UK? Oh yeah, we use those quite a lot. In fact, I know that I know that product. It's a, it's a very popular product over here right now. So yeah, called the magic. Uh, yeah, and so yeah, it, it is magical in that you know what it, it fits the bill. And I hate to keep putting this in front of my face, but I'd rather you know have you look at the product instead of my face. But <laughs> you can see that people can just keep playing around with it and like wow. And so your marketing messages just keep moving around. And uh, you know this is just a a fantastic idea. It also comes with a a little uh, a stand that now you can you've created this where it just stays right on your desk. Oop. Yeah, it's kind of it's kind of like a stress ball, but better because you can put a lot more messages on there. And people will oh, pick I, it up when they're just feeling bored or they're just feeling like yeah. doing something else besides working. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> And you know it's the size of like a Rubik's cube, the the regular size Rubik's cube. Um, and it, it, believe me, it's a lot less frustrating than a Rubik's cube. So <laughs> I'd rather have this than uh, than a Rubik's cube. I'm not much of a puzzle guy. I get too oh, no, yeah. frustrated <laughs> too easily for that. But uh, so that is you know another great item. Oh, by the way, yeah, I know that we want to kind of keep this to 20 minutes, and we're really kind of up up against time here. And so I'll be brief. I just have uh, one more item that I wanted to share that I just really, really love. And this comes in a nice, you know, white gift box, uh, so it's easy to, to distribute. Um, foldable headphones. Now, headphones are nothing new. Um, you know, the brand Beats has brought these to the forefront. Sony is, you know, jumps on board. Um, and... So these are over-the-ear headphones that are you know, foldable. They break down mm -hmm. so that you can use, easily travel with them, put them in a little bag. And then uh, it gives you a little uh, imprint area on the side. Are those Bluetooth? Uh, no, these are not Bluetooth. These are wired. Right. Uh, and they're wired for regular smartphones or iPods or uh, any musical device that you have. And the sound is unbelievable. So, you know, the Beats brand, uh, what do they cost you? $200, $300 a, a pair? Maybe yeah. $129, $139 for the smaller over the year. Um, you know, this is a an industry promotional item. I think these are about 11 or $12 a piece. Yeah, and I'll bet you they're, ma they're, they're manufactured by, I mean, in the same way. I, we, I've seen a lot of uh, headsets coming out recently for the promotional market, and the sound is really good. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I mean, the, the, the kind of quality of sound that, uh, you know, is in the technology, even for the promotional. And, you know, th sometimes people look at these and go, eh, I don't know, the sound's usually not very good in, in the promotional type ones. I don't know if I want to do it, but man, you know, when you when you actually put these on and you plug it in and play a song on your iPhone or you know iPad or whatever your music is on, the sound is amazing. It really is. I'm 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 very surprised because they didn't used to be, uh, but now they are. It's a, it's much better. So that really is my roundup of uh, some of the top items that I found at the ASR Orlando show uh, in January for our promotional product industry. And um, what do you think, Dan? I think you got a good selection there. And they're different things, you know. They're, they're, the thing, they're up and coming things, and they're, they're, they're products that people can use. Which, of course, we always go, we always beat this back and forth. Say, so, you know, that's that's the most important thing. And those are all products that people are going to find useful. So it's, I mean, they are good, good promotional products in the first, you know, Yeah, yeah, and it's great because, you know, um, Halo, who I'm affiliated with, we have an end user show coming up uh, here in a couple of weeks in February, and these five items were, are they're going to be featured in the new product uh, um, category in, like, a showcase. So, right. uh, 
yeah, so I, uh, you guys, uh, whoever's watching this, uh, gets a sneak peek of you know the uh, actual display that's going to be on at a trade show. And if you're in the Orlando area, February twentieth, uh, you, know, you need to get registered. So you need to contact me first, and I'd send you a registration link. But we have an end user show where you can come over, and we have seventy different vendors uh, that are going to be setting up all their wares. You can walk through, you can touch and feel thousands of different promotional products to figure out which ones are going to be best for you. Um, again, that's February 20th uh, here in Orlando. If you're in the Central Florida area, please get a hold of me and I'll, we can get you registered up so that you can come in. And it's called a picnic with, uh, with Halo. You get free parking, you get free lunch, and uh, a whole bunch of marketing ideas for your business. Sounds, sounds like the place to be. <laughs> I like to be in Orlando right now with all the snow coming down outside. <laughs> oh yeah, well I tell you what, it's it's been cold, but it's warming up. It's supposed right. to be in the mid to low 70s, uh, you know, for the rest of this week. So yes, we're very thankful. I'm wearing a sweatshirt. I don't like wearing sweatshirts. I don't like being cold. <laughs> <laughs> well, actually, no I'm, I'm quite cold, but I'm wearing a t-shirt, so that's probably why. <laughs> well, you, you probably got a fire going, uh, or at least the heater. Yeah, oh yeah, I do have that. <laughs> So, well, anyway, uh, I know that we've run over just a few minutes. Uh, thank you very much for watching uh, uh, this particular episode of the Promotional Products Show. And uh, with that, I will say, uh, we'll bid you adieu. And uh, until next time, I'm John Clark with Palm Tree Promotions, and my co host is Dan Toombs with CompuGift. And we'll see you on the next episode. Yes, goodbye. Thanks a lot. All right. <laughs>